welcome you all for the session of uh, theory of computation now we are going to design about uh, the problem of TFA given sigma equal to a comma b analyze and construct a DFA which recognize the language L equal to b power n a into b power n such that n comma n is greater than 0 for this we need to uh, develop a language for this here here they are saying uh, m and n is greater than 0 so um, b can be any number of b's and you're having an a and it is followed by any number of b's right so for this we can uh, write like this B B A B B B B B A B B B B etc. So uh, in between only one A is occurred and followed by B's. It is any number of B's. After that, there is no uh, there is no A will be followed. So we'll keep in mind uh, B is followed by A and A is followed by uh, B, right? So it is any number of a, sorry, any number of b and any any number of uh, b's, right? Uh, followed by a and followed by b's. So here we need to uh, draw DFA for this. So will b, and you are having only one a. After that, you are having another b. I'll say the state a name it as b c and d right here uh, from state a we should start only using a b's not a's that's why it should not start with a that's why i put this a in a trap state which is known as e and what are the input you are getting it is trapped out over here right after that, here we'll get any number of b's over here. That's why b uh, in from state b you are getting this b. So uh, in this DFA you are having uh, a's uh, coming out and b is also coming out from state b. And you are having uh, in state c your uh, b only b is available. You need to draw a. But here uh, there should be only one A uh, which is followed by any number of B's. That's why you will make this state from C only the A will be connected to this trap state. Why? Because there is uh, there should be only one A followed by B any number of B's and after that you have you will have this uh, you know state d this is known as final state in this final state uh, b followed by any number of uh, a and you're having followed by any number of b's and you'll provide this b here over here and now there should be no a's should be followed that's why we'll provide this a over here so uh, the diagram should be look like this so we'll check any one of the string by using this say w equal to b b a b b right for this so it starts from a when you give input to b it goes to b and again it goes to it gets an input b and it goes to b itself after that you are having a for a it goes to c right after that we'll have a b so this b is over here and reaches d and another b so anyway it is a final state so it's also in d and after that it is again is get an input b it has that uh, state on d so the string is accepted right so this is the way you have to draw a diagram for l equal to b power n 
into a in b power n such that m comma n is greater than 0. Thank you for watching. We will see in the next video.